everyone welcome back to my channel I have missed y'all so much um, I'm just trying to get back to normal after the accident and um, I have to say during um, April that we were healing um, I did a little bit of shopping online <laughs> but it was kind of like a I needed to because I was in pain and I just had to have some stuff right <laughs> So let's just get to it. I'm actually gonna do, put these in a several different videos. <laughs> so it's not like too long. So it's not too long. Okay, so let's just get to it because I just tend to ramble. Let's start with ColourPop. I have um, some of their shadows and wanted to have a few of their lippies. So let me show you what I got. The first one, and let me see which pencils here. Westy, okay, now this color, I got the lip pencil and the lipstick. So let's see here. This is Westy. And here is the lipstick and here is the lip liner. Very nice. I thought this would be a beautiful color for summer. And I got, now I did not see a lip liner for this, but it's cookie and I just figured one of the ones that I have already would work. And here is cookie. These really are nice. I really like these lipsticks. Now the third one is um, Lumiere, is that it? I'm sure you've heard about it on YouTube, but of course I would mispronounce it most likely. And love this color. There's the lipstick and lip liner. So, um, these are all the things that I got from ColourPop. I will say I really do like the lip liners. Um, and I do like the lipsticks. They have a great staying power. Um, they're not drying on the lips. They really are lovely. I will say if I had to pick one thing that I do not like about them is their packaging. I don't like this. Um, I don't like the packaging on the lip liners. It just seems like the tops come off easily to me. So, um, other than that, I really do like the product itself. So, do love that. Okay, so that was ColourPop. Let me put that over there. So next, um, Ulta was having a sale um, on their next products. I think it was buy one, get one half off. And I wanted to go ahead and get another one of their micro brow pencils because um, might as well get it when it's on sale because I know I'm going to need another one, right? Because uh, this is my go-to thing right now for my brows. Really do love it. Um, it makes me just as happy as the Anastasia Brow Wiz, and we know how much I love that. I mean, I use that forever. Um, this is in the color Chocolate. Um, really, really do like these brow pencils. Even the spoolie on the end is nice, just like the Anastasia, so love it. Um, and the next thing, I got another lippy. Sorry, I just, uh, you know, couldn't resist. I got the color of, this was the High Voltage Lipstick in Flutter Kisses. And again, sure you've heard it all over YouTube. And I seriously love this color. Absolutely love it really is a beautiful color and I do like wearing this there again it is not drying on the lips whatsoever oh, I thought my computer just beeped at me <laughs> oh well it's still going uh, let's see where was I um, yeah it's not drying at all it's moisturizing and um, it has nice staying power so I like it I like it a lot okay so last place we're going to talk about this video is Target or Target, which you may call it. Um, I got this. This is the Nip Plus Fab Glycolic Fix Body Cream. That's a tongue twister. 
Uh, it's a skin refining body cream. This is what it looks like. This, I believe this is like a new item or a new line that Target carries. And I got this to use on my neck, chest, and decollete area. Sorry if the color is changing. There we go. Um, it's very nice. It does not irritate the skin at all. And it's basically just a good way to, uh, you know, get everything else exfoliating. You exfoliate your face, you need to exfoliate everything else, right? And this is an excellent body cream for that. Um, I got an eye cream. It's the Neutrogena Hydro Boost Gel Cream. Um, it has hyaluronic acid in it. Um, this is okay. Uh, I mean, it's not the best eye cream I've ever had, but it is okay. And uh, yeah, it has hyaluronic acid, so I mean, it is moisturizing. So I just, I just really don't have. I haven't used it well long enough to get a good, you know, because skincare really takes a little bit of time before you can make a valid, you know, decision on it one way or the other. So I will keep you posted. Okay, next we're going to go to um, a mascara. It's the L'Oreal Telescopic Carbon Black. This is not um, something that is a shocker. This is something also all seen on YouTube. It's a wonderful mascara. Really lengthens your lashes. Um, a nice small brush. But I will say one time I was in a hurry or wasn't paying attention or both. And when I went to put it back in, I was, I missed it and I bent it right here. And it really is kind of flimsy. But I still use it. It's kind of hard to get it into the hole. Um, but still, I still use it and it really, really, really does give great lashes. Um, not volume, but length. Uh, like seriously. So I really do like it. And still, um, even if I use a different mascara, a lot of times I will go over it with this just to comb it out and uh, to get some more length in there. So really great. Uh, I got a e.l.f. small tapered brush. Got this and as you can see, it is dirty because I did use it. Um, I love this for under the eye. It is very soft and works beautifully. I love it. And what was it, like $3? Hello? Seriously? All right. this foundation. I have been wearing this like you would not believe. It is the Revlon Color Stay. This is the um, I just saw that I got the one for combination to oily skin. It was on the rack for the combination to dry skin I believe. Oh well. Anyway, even though it's for oily skin, <laughs> it is working beautifully. It's the Revlon Color Stay um, Foundation. It says 24 hour. I love this stuff. It goes on beautifully. It's thick to get it out of here. There's no pump, of course. It's just like this. I generally have to stick a Q-tip in there um, to get product out. But once you put it on your face, you just need a little bit because it seriously blends out beautifully. Um, again, just a little bit. If you put too much, you're going to look like it. I mean, because when you start trying to blend it out, it blends so easily, you're just going to have too much. So just a little bit. But really is beautiful. I say it's about a medium coverage. And um, yeah, I like it. I don't know if it stays on for 24 hours because quite frankly, uh, I wash my face every night and every morning. So I don't ever have makeup on for 24 hours. Okay, last but not least, this is something that I, you know, should I get it, should I not, should I get it, should I not, for quite a while. And finally, the should get it one, and I got the L'Oreal uh, La Palette Nude 2. Love this thing. What really pushed me over was when I went to see, because I really wanted the Tartlet palette. And when I went to Ulta, they didn't have one that hadn't been opened. And the one that had been opened, of course, had everyone's fingers had been in it. And once the oil from your fingers touched the product, 
and everyone else's oils are touching the product, it distorts the color. And I really didn't like the way it looked, obviously, because um, everybody was touching it with their oil. <laughs> Um, so the next time I was at the store, I believe Target, yes, Target, um, I saw this and I got it. And can I tell you, this is worth the money. I believe it was $15. You can always find L'Oreal coupons in the Sunday paper. And if you don't have it, you should. I don't have the first one. I wanted the second one just for the plums. Um, I just really wanted these, this kind of color. So, I'm very happy with it. They are very creamy. They are not too powdery. They really are. They rival some more of the more expensive eyeshadows that I have. So, I really, really do like it. So, um, let me know. Thumbs up if you want to see a look from this palette. Because, yes, I am going to start doing some looks. I promise. Life is getting back to normal. Slowly but surely. Okay, so this is all of this haul that I have for you. Uh, let me know if you have any questions. And yeah, don't go too far because I'll be filming some other videos right after this one because there's just more to show you. Love y'all.